A husband enraged that his wife might be having an affair. What happened next, we have to warn you, is so violent it may not be appropriate for some viewers. This woman has two black eyes. The result, cops say, of a beating by her enraged husband after he discovered she was having an affair with a co-worker. What authorities say happened next is shocking. This case is especially heinous and gruesome. 31-year-old Brittany Barron told police her husband Armando was looking through her phone when he found text messages from her co-worker Jonathan Amaralt. They both worked at a medical supply company in New Hampshire. Brittany said what followed was a violent assault with her husband beating her about the face repeatedly and strangling her so hard she says she passed out. Then her husband texted her lover pretending to be Brittany and lured him to meet at a park in the woods. When Amaralt showed up for the middle of the night rendezvous with his alleged lover, a grim fate awaited him. That's when Brittany told investigators her husband turned and shot Jonathan three times twice in the chest and once in the head. The couple then drove 200 miles with the body into the deep forests of New Hampshire, where the husband ordered Brittany to cut off Jonathan's head with a saw so that he could not be identified, according to court documents. The defendant decapitated Jonathan wrapped his head in a tarp and placed it in a grave. The gruesome crime was exposed when fish and game officers happened to come upon the scene. Armando Barron has pled not guilty to murder. His wife was charged with falsifying physical evidence. She pled not guilty when she appeared in court, and you could still see those two black eyes. You can hear me, right? Yes, I can. Her lawyer, Richard Guerriero. Everything that the state alleges that Ms. Barron did, she did under duress, and I mean under duress, meaning direct fear from her for